It sounds beautiful. All right, we're starting fresh. <laughs> we're starting fresh. fresh, dude. There was, <laughs> there was discourse. We, you guys missed a lot. Um, we fucked up. It's my birthday. <laughs> Yippee! I'm 24. It's Ethan's birthday. We talked. Holy that's actually fucked up. You have to understand. We've been talking for an hour and a fucking half or whatever it is. Yeah. And I'm sorry for saying the effort so early in the video. Okay. I mean, yeah, you guys missed out on, on Diddy Talk and fucking trafficking, trafficking and and traffic statistics, just traffic in general. I had my Little Caesar story. You had a dream and then he had his birthday. It was in my birthday. I was wearing stupid party hats and I'm covering my greasy ass hair with a stupid party hat. Yeah. Okay. That sucks, dude. That does suck God because damn it. I needed to ask you. Save it for the Patreon. I already know. Save it for the Patreon. I already know. Yeah, put the shit episode on Patreon <laughs> yeah. and put the good episode. Yeah. For free. Yeah. Good idea, man. Well, Patreon, you get. No, that's garbage. It's worthless. You get now. unedited content on the Patreon. It's worthless. It's only hey, 50. Guys, we saw the comments. No, for real. Listen up. We saw the comments. We saw how the background was lame and there's a hundred comments about it there was like 50 75 comments about how plain the background was 87 and how plain the, 87 yeah thank you so we did add the oppenheimer thing we're not going to talk about oppenheimer or even reference oppenheimer it. what oppenheimer <laughs> oh thanks thanks yeah. no sorry oppenheimer yeah oppenheimer no and then we have a nice on air thing so now the yeah. now the set is a little more busy it's a little more visually interesting yeah we also have these cool hats I mean, courtesy of our, uh, the of the Dollar Tree, of our art director of uh, Stacy uh, Big Tits, Holman. yeah, dude, <laughs> just call her Big Tits. <laughs> Cut all this. Stacey, call her Big Tits. <laughs> Stacy, <laughs> hey Stacy, <laughs> smack her. Tits. No, you wouldn't do that. You wouldn't smack her tits. What if her last name was Big Tits, but she what had little fucking mosquito <laughs> bites? Your name is Big Tits. <laughs> Hey, Stacy Big Tits. <laughs> what if you smacked a woman's tits? You they would not like that at you all. You would go to jail. You can't what, smack they a girl. What, they go to jail? You can't smack a girl's tits. What if you smacked your girlfriend's tits? <laughs> That's, That's very not It nice. depends on her mood. You might go to hell. You might. <laughs> it depends on her fucking. She sends you to hell. <laughs> Punch your tits. That's pretty funny. Have you ever had anyone slap your tits before? Every day. <laughs> Ethan, what? Every fucking day. You can't have tits as a man and not get your tits slapped. What do you mean, dude? Simple as that. Who's smacking your tits around? What the fuck are you talking about? Literally everyone that I know that's, like, cool. Yeah? Like, hey, Hey, Gary, Gary. what's up? Good morning, (laughs) Gary. It's literally Tit Slap Central. I will say, my brother is um, big, and I I always You mean obese. Yeah, fat. I, dude. Please say the medical term, (laughs) obese. That's the only way I'll respond. I I have boxes tits. Uppercut them? That's pretty funny. They're heavy. They're like yeah, sandbags, like twenty hilarious. pound sandbags, dude. What's funnier than that? Um, probably. There's very little funnier than smacking a guy's tits. A guy's tits. Yeah. Probably a nut, a nut jab. Quick. No, that's not funny at all. It's kind of gay, that's actually. Dead serious. Dead serious. It's funny when it happens by accident. It's not funny. Accident isn't guy. funny. What? That's fighting. It's funny when it happens by accident. It's funny when a Chinese guy gets okay. his head torn off in a factory Whoa. accident. Fuck, dude. It's funny when you're seeing okay. live leak footage of a traffic accident. It's funny when a girl, a girl in high heels steps on kittens. <laughs> guy sticks his knife. I've never seen that. Yeah, we, Did you see that? We watched it together. Did we? Yeah. What? Yeah. You got, really? Yeah, you, you got the dark web and it instantly... No like, fucking way! Hey, Ethan, do you want to see a few things? Did I really... Do we really see that? Yeah, we saw that. We saw a guy sticking a knife up his It was his a butt. guy stepping on a fucking... No, it was a girl. a lady stepping on a cat? Yeah. Oh my god. <laughs> yeah, it was fucked up, Holy dude. Holy fuck, I forgot about that, dude. It sucks, I dude. literally... Ethan, what's fucked up is I literally don't remember it. I think okay. it was so fucked up that my brain like pushed it. I remember the guy with the knife in his ass. Dude, that was funny. That was, that was crazy. <laughs> that was... <laughs> <laughs> what is he doing, dude? It better have been fucking oh, dull. Oh, oh, oh. That's yeah, crazy, that was it was a man. steak knife. It was a big like fucking chopping knife. No, it wasn't. Yes, it was. You it was like a kitchen knife. You can't stick a chef's knife up your ass. It was a big Gordon Ramsay chef. No, knife. dude, it was a yes, steak knife. Yes, it was. Yes, it was, dude. It was not serrated. It was a big fucking Gordon Ramsay sure? chef knife. Yeah. It was Gordon Ramsay's brand. Gordon Calm Ramsay's down. Brand You're going to make me calm if you keep talking about sticking knives up each other's asses. That is crazy to say, by the way. Yeah, of course. It's not normal. But that's where they did it, though, that's right? Unexpected. That's where they did it. Well, <laughs> that's that you would say that is very unexpected. It's so, what were you going to say? That's why they did it, though, right? Because it turned him on? Yes, obviously. Okay, there's no other reason. That's masochistic. <laughs> there was probably a gerbil in his ass that he was trying to kill. He was trying to kill the gerbil in his ass. 
<laughs> there's no other like, way. There's the debater. There's no other he way to get it. Out. He was killing an intruder. Was he on fucking heroin? There's no other way to get it out of the out of get him out of his asshole. Yeah, he stuck a knife up there. <laughs> That's fucking insane. <laughs> Why would he do that? Just the knife in the, the gerbil. Holy shit, dude. Fuck. Get this out of me. It's like pouring water on a fucking oil fire. Yeah, or dude. Gas you had to fix it. <laughs> it's the only way. God this is damn. a much better episode already. Immediately? Yeah. yeah thank, thank God, God. practice. Yeah, arguing about fucking Asian people <laughs> driving. <laughs> There are worse drivers than Star Wars, and I'm just gonna fucking put my foot down. That's the say, oldest, oldest joke in the book. Fuck. It's not a joke, it's fucking real. It's not even a joke. We're arguing facts over fiction right now. We were we were arguing facts over fiction, and you're yeah. a fucking. You're but a how, denier, dude. How, how mad does your dad get when he gets cut off and it's a woman? You no. Know. My dad gets fucking angry, dude. Really? He's like, fucking, is that a girl? Yep. Looks at me. Oh, really? He's like, I fucking knew it. Ethan. I'm See, like, that's a big factor, because I didn't like, know there was that generational trauma. Dad, father, chill oh, out. Dad, look at the statistics, please. <laughs> it's not as bad as it seems. That's actually an outlier. <laughs> dad, every single experience you've ever had in your life has been an outlier. I'm 12 years old reading off to my dad <laughs> traffic statistics. Yeah, you're fucking all, the numbers are fudged. You're faking all the numbers. It's not real, Dad. Look, check him out. <laughs> Fuck. <laughs> Fuck! Slams on the brakes, hits the horn. Fuck! Looks at dude. My dad slammed on the brakes one time. I was I'm, I, I was in middle school or even elementary, and he slammed on the brakes after getting cut off in a roundabout. Uh-huh. And he explained to me angrily like how to yield in a in a traffic circle. Uh huh. And it's funny. I, I was just thinking back to it. Like I'm I might am I supposed to like who? Why are you yelling at me about this? Yeah. He's like you're supposed to wait until you're not supposed to merge during the traffic circle. Uh huh. It's just weird. Like, why would he yell at me? Driving is fucking crazy. But yeah. it's like... It's, Especially with women, women on the road. I do like... I do like fucking... You ever flip someone off? <laughs> yeah, I did, dude. Yeah. It was it was not you deserved. Do it? They, didn't, they didn't deserve... Oh, no. It was did. not deserved, dude. It was an old lady? <laughs> no, it was... What is she doing? Is she waving hi? She was in a... So, okay. <laughs> <laughs> no. So you're you're actually just lying about these statistics to make no. pass sins. I did flip off a woman, but I was in the wrong. I was in the wrong. That's extra funny. It's so I, I remember I was dropping. You're smoking a big cigar. No, I was so so no, I was dropping off my mom at the grocery store, mm-hmm. and I dropped her off like in the path of oncoming traffic, and and I and instead of dropping her off right at the entrance, I dropped her off at like a lane away. Um, it was at the one in our hometown, um, and she's walking in, and this car was beeping at me in front of me, like. Like why why like why aren't you dropping her off at the entrance? Why are you dropping her off like ten feet away? Oh interesting. And I drove around the girl and she was like Oh. Like what's wrong with you? And I was just like Yeah. And I kept driving. What sucks is that no, I No, that's I, deserved. I know her. I know the girl that I flipped off. Oh my god. She works at the deli. She works at the deli. That's funny. Was it while you were working at the No. It wasn't you get, you worked at a Piggly Wiggly. Yeah, you guys see the Piggly Wiggly dude? What's wrong with that? Is that a local chain? Um it's Midwestern. Yeah. But no, I did work at it was at a Piggly Wiggly. She worked at the deli section at a Piggly Wiggly. I was. And were you working there at the time? I was not, but oh, okay. she, I worked there for a number of years, and she definitely knew me. And I was in the wrong, and I just flipped her off because, like, why, why, you, why, why? But she was why, honking at you. Why get mad at me? But she was honking at you. Correct. So you weren't in the wrong. I was. Like why? How? Because I dropped my mom off in the most inconvenient spot in the parking lot. Was it right at the entrance to the parking lot? It was. No, like, no, you no, 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 turn no. Off into the parking lot and right there right? no no it was uh so be, so where she was coming from she couldn't get around me because only only way that she could get around me was if she hit my mom it was my mom my car and then like a bunch of other cars and carts yeah so she could not get she had to wait for me to drive around her what is so fucking urgent i don't pe- fucking getting know, to her job she had to get to the was fucking she in the uniform she had to get to the chris gas station to buy some fucking new cigarettes yeah Fuck her shit, dude. Fucking I'm on your Cigarettes side, man. Are fucking I'm on your side. It was her fault, yeah. It was her fault. Yeah. She deserved to be flipped off. I don't think you should think... Listen, man. She started it. Yeah. She started it. She was honking at you, dude. You Some, everyone else has patience. Mm. Here, this is a thing in short supply nowadays. I should have parked my this car and gone up, gone up to her window like... 
Yeah, with a crow with a baseball bat. With the crowbar. And a crowbar. Yeah. yeah. And you're like dueled. <laughs> okay. Stab her eye with a dueling cup. baseball bats. Yeah. <laughs> you're doing crazy shit like flipping them around. <laughs> you're fucking dead serious about it. You're fucking gonna kill her. Yeah. You're dead serious. Fucking flipping your baseball bats around. Kick her ass in front of the brat stand. <laughs> also, I do, I do appreciate how these beers look like I'm drinking out of a fucking like elixir. A, yeah, like a medicine. Yeah, like a medicine it bottle. Is, it is nice. It's like. That's what I like about it. They're little stubbies. Yeah. It feels like it's the 1850s or something, and this is snake yeah, oil. Yeah, this is about the size of fucking... Oh, shit. This is about the size of uh, um, Lawrence Pugh's, Florence Pugh's nipples in Oppenheimer. I literally... Do you remember the first thing I fucking said about this? I want to talk about this. So I want you to really th- do... Did you have things written down? No. So well, you should whip out that big, like... There's a notebook with like where we talk about st- topics, so you should have wrote this down. Because mm-hmm. I would have had stuff to say too. The, do you send it to me about the well? nipple crisis? Do you crisis? share it with me like that? We're gonna talk about her. What's her name? Florence Pugh. <laughs> What's her name? <laughs> Florence, Florence Pugh. Florence Pugh's. Florence Pugh. They were really brown too. The nipples. I don't, I don't remember that. Might you have remember been... how brown the no, nipples I don't. were? No, that might have been See, a tent. See, I don't remember how big and brown. So they were pretty stop, big. Stop, stop. It wasn't brown. Dude. They were really big, but they were also brown. Look at the up. I remember how brown <laughs> the nipple was. You're d- that you, could have been. Now you are attacking directly my memory of the event of seeing the nipple, <laughs> and I remember the nipple and how brown it was and how big it was. That could have been the tent. Because it looked like a fucking brown milk that it literally looked like a piece of chocolate. <laughs> You're like, God, I'm so fucking hungry. I'm <laughs> hungry for milk, and I'm hungry for her nipple, and I'm hungry for chocolate. As well her brown fucking nipple please Florence if you suck Pugh, nipple, please it would feel like a fucking thumb <laughs> it'd feel like you're sucking it'd your thumb. feel like home yeah exactly yeah you'd feel like oh, damn. It's fucking it's like a thumb up to the fucking knuckle dude God that's damn, crazy dude you know in look a... up her nipples dude <sighs> fucking i'm not always... i'm not gonna look oh, up why not oh I'm white. who's just checking your history on your laptop it's for the podcast that's not, that's not the point it's for the fucking podcast look up her nipples mm. right fucking now no dude. i'm and not talk about how no. brown they are because they are fucking brown, <laughs> and they look like milk duds. Okay, so if you... S- and that's the only fucking thing I remember about Oppenheimer. You know, that's the only thing? I remember Robert Downey Jr. or whatever is looking at the bomb, and he's going... <laughs> he's covering his mouth, and Oppenheimer's like... <sighs> yeah. And they're all, oh, boo, fucking who? Josh. I dropped the bomb! Goddamn pussy! Yeah, Josh from Drake and Josh is drinking off in the corner. He's a, Yeah, he's like... <laughs> <laughs> Did the bomb go off yet? Oh! <laughs> yeah. That was great. Do you think he Somebody actually... was simultaneously coming as the bomb exploded. Like there? Probably or just... within 100 miles. Oh, yeah. Of course. In 100 miles, someone is... Someone was coming. It's at coming the same right moment. now. As Even right now, as we're having this conversation, someone at the goddamn factory is rubbing one out. Who do you think is the closest people having gay sex? <sighs> How far away is your house? <laughs> What's that mean? I'm here. <laughs> You guys. What the fuck does that mean? What does that mean? That they're in my house fucking? Yeah. Just yeah. random guys? Yeah. What the fuck are you talking about? Yeah, dude. I'm here. Yeah. <laughs> what the fuck are you talking about? That literally made zero sense. You're multiple... Even if it was a dig on me, that made zero sense. <laughs> my dad is gay? Fuck you. Your dad's gay, bitch. What Your the dad. fuck? It's fucking retarded. Shut the fuck oh, up. Oh, shit. Are you still talking about her nipples or are we talking about something else right talking now? talking about gay sex. We're talking about the... <laughs> How close do you think the nearest people having gay sex is? Is it within 10? It's no. a, 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 within 200 feet? There is someone with the pride flag a few a few houses I remember down. that. They took it down, though, and they replaced it with a Wu-Tang Clan flag. That wasn't them. That was funny. a different house. Really? Yeah. Wu-Tang is all the way at the end of the block. Oh. But the person with the pride flag, they did take it down, but they got to be gay, right? Because if you support gay pride, you wouldn't just stick a flag. Someone they know is gay. It's probably their... It's either their child. It's their child. Oh, that could be it. It's like they have a gay kid. But the chances of them also having sex in the small... It's also 5.30. Who's having sex at 5.30 on a work day? True. Very People true. are in, stuck in traffic. Yeah. People and are getting sucks. rear-ended. What? Yeah. When is When does sex happen, mostly? At night. And I don't know anything about this. Or in the morning. Morning? Yeah. Morning or night. Would you say I do mostly something night. like 70% at night, 30% in the morning? I would say 90-10. 95-5. Really? 
Yeah, dude, who's fucking at... What about past midnight, though? Does that include morning? No. That's not... That's still night, definitely. Correct. Definitely. How much sex do you think happens past midnight? Is there a study on this? Dude, who... How do you even get that? There's no way to even <laughs> fact check it's that. It's self-reported. Yeah. It it's is. gotta be self-reported. Um, I, well, I have a bunch of sex after 9 p.m., so... <laughs> it's some guy making it up. <laughs> yeah. It's me making it up. <laughs> I participated in the study. Uh, 90%. <laughs> what the fuck was that? Fartsy. <laughs> the fuck are you talking about? He's just going completely fucking. He's gone. He's <laughs> lost it. Here, I started before the fucking recording. He farts got fucked. during the interview. <laughs> before the recording got fucked. I was saying I wasn't Say his lucid. Name. Say his... <laughs> I was saying I wasn't lucid. Say completely Say lost his, the is it, is that plot, my... bro. Yes, his name is that. <laughs> Okay. But I'll, fucking, I'll, I'll believe that. But you that's better fun. remember to do that shit. <laughs> you did. I'll listen to it. He's like gonna get angry times. at you. You say my, you say a fart. A you say I a, should say his first and last name. Bro. <laughs> you say a fart on work, dude. You can't. Oh my belly hurts. Oh. All right, tell the story. To them. <laughs> <laughs> this guy I worked with. I work at a fucking Arby's, okay, and I used to. <laughs> I quit literally a week ago. I didn't tell any of them about the channel, so I don't give a fuck. Surprise, surprise, out. a fat dude that works at Arby's farts. Shut the fuck up. Wait, yeah. <laughs> so you're calling me the fat dude. <laughs> no, 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 no. That's not the point of the story no, at all. No, no, no. That's not the point of the story no, at all. No, no, no. That's not the point of the story at all. Okay, yeah. Please. Continue. Because he's 450 pounds. Yes. Now, I don't know about you, but to me, that is morbidly <laughs> obese. That is very obese, okay? So he's extraordinarily disgusting. God damn. He's disgustingly fat, okay? okay. Disgustingly. <laughs> Makes me want to fucking vomit just, every time I see dude, him. Dude, chill out. Stop. Hey, Stop. hey, Stop. hey. I need you to fucking pay attention to fat. my story. You don't, you don't. He's disgustingly morbidly fat, okay? Yeah. <laughs> and listen, I'm not saying I'm that far off, okay? Yeah. Whatever. He's standing there. He's standing there, all right? Nothing's going on. We're all just standing there because there's nothing to do because there's no customers, right? And he's sitting there rubbing his fucking belly and he's going, oh, <laughs> wait, 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 okay, hold on. Because he fucking, he fucking always goes and eats yeah. Chinese food, bro. Oh, you know where this dude. is. Oh, no. Bleep no. that part, too, because that's a location giveaway. Why did right? he go there? Yes, it's the disgusting Chinese place with fucking hair in the food. There's hair in the fucking orange chicken, okay? And he always eats there and he's like, oh. <laughs> Mike's stomach hurts. He goes, Oh, my belly hurts. Oh, he fucking rips ass, dude. Rips the fucking loudest, stinkiest fucking rip ass. <laughs> what is he supposed right to do? Right in front of fucking everyone, What dude. is he supposed to do? <laughs> I'm just, I just think, I just think that that's disrespectful. He can't, he can't hold it, dude. I just think that <laughs> it's that's a medical condition. Why are you standing there rubbing your belly, saying your belly hurts and farting? Fuck you, dude. You're a fucking piece of shit. Go somewhere else. The second you even start to feel your belly hurting, go to the bathroom. <laughs> I gotta go, girl. I gotta... Don't even tell anyone. I don't care. <laughs> go fucking shit, dude. Get it over with. Get it done with. Well, you're a manager, so yeah. The you bathroom were... belongs. Well, you, you were his boss, right? Yeah, I was. You should have. You should have. You should have. You should have brought him up. I should have, because that's fucking horrid. Farts. Have some fucking respect. Farted. While working loudly. No. The the bad part is, here's the <laughs> shitty part, okay? I don't care if you fucking rip ass. If it's yeah. loud and out of nowhere, it's hilarious. But if you're standing there rubbing your belly going, Oh, my belly hurts. Oh, I have to shit. Oh. And then you rip ass? You're <laughs> fucked up. You're fucked in the head. What's your fucking problem, dude? What the fuck is that? That's like malicious. Here's the thing. That's Gary. malevolent. You tell bad stories about him, but like that is so funny, dude. <laughs> like I'm on his side. Why are you on his side? Fuck him, dude. That's funny. That's dude. fucking bullshit. You just you're on his side because he confuses me. Because you fucking hate me. Wait, wait. wait. Have, have you ever got caught in a fart? Huh? Yeah. Have you ever farted by yourself and someone walks in? No. No. Well, probably. I just. It's they don't like say nothing. Anything. Well, what the fuck? They they came up to me, you know what I mean? Well, like, let's say you're... I'm, in, I'm dwelling, and they yeah. came up into my dwelling. Yeah. Well, your dwelling is usually an open an open space. Sure. Yeah. Have you you've never been caught in a fart? So do you have a story, or what? No. I I've, don't have one. I've left rooms that I farted in, because I don't want to get caught. That's pretty funny. Because I don't want to get caught Dude, in that's, there. 
That's more respectful. I've worked. That is more respectful. If you sat in that same room and you're rubbing your belly and you're like, oh, I have to shit all my belly hurts. And then you ripped ass and then everyone knew it was you because you were ripping ass and you said you were going to rip yeah. ass. In front, my, in front of my boss. That's you want to oh. be discovered. That's like people that like, they murder a bunch of people and then they're like, yeah, it was me. You know yeah, it's mean? like Telltale Heart. Yeah, exactly. Felt guilty. Exactly. God, dude. What a fucking loser farting in front of people. <laughs> rubbing his belly. <laughs> Listen, man. Cut him with some fucking slack. And now you're on his side? Yeah, now I'm on his side. Yeah, okay. I love him. Cool. I do love cool. him. What a funny story. <laughs> <laughs> I don't want to shit on him too hard. Yeah, you shit himself. I do love him. Oh, Gary, some poop came out. <laughs> <laughs> oh, <laughs> some poop came out. God damn it. You've shit your pants, obviously. <laughs> That's a good segue. <laughs> yeah, yeah. You've shit your pants, obviously. <laughs> tell us about that. Yeah. Hey, Gary, tell us about the time you shit your pants. <laughs> fuck you, dude. What the fuck? When I, when I was 12. I should start doing this to you, dude. When I was 12, I shit in my adventure time pajamas. <laughs> yeah, that's nice. I wasn't wearing undies for some reason. I was just like, it's a fart. So it's just in oh. your pajamas? Yeah. Damn. I had Finn and Jake on it. That's tough. <laughs> They're a fuzzy. It's tough as nails. It Do you is. keep the pajamas or no? They got thrown out. They had to get thrown out, dude. It was a I classic grade A. Can't keep them. How about you? Ruinous. Ruinous pants shit. You've ruined pants? Is that what you just said? I said that, that was a ruinous pants shit. I see, I see. But um. But have you ruined Did I tell you about jeans? my fucking... Um, there was this kid, right? Mm-hmm. And he was like, if you eat apple seeds, you fucking die. <laughs> I told you this. Yeah, that's a, keep going. That's this fine. is the last poop yeah. my pants story yeah. I have because I only have the one, okay? Yeah. Because this is the one I most consciously remember because I was in like junior year of high school. Yeah, what have you said? What do you mean? What do you mean? Whatever you say, dude. Shit, you fucking shit your, your pants, pants yesterday. You were dude. junior in high school and you were shitting your pants? What the yes, fuck is wrong? No, listen. Listen. Put the mic in Shut front of Shut the fuck up. Put fuck the you, mic dude. In front of your fuck face. you. Oh, yeah. No, I don't want to listen to you. I fucking hate your shit, dude. Put the... nasty. Happy birthday, fucker. Yeah. Fuck your shit. Tell, tell, tell your shit story. Fuck your shit, dude. Happened like five years ago. Yeah. Fuck. Yes. Yeah, okay. Yeah. Yeah, it did. You tell know what? I'm not fucking ashamed, dude. Tell your shit story. I'm not fucking doing? ashamed, bro. I should write like, I'll, I'll, I'll fucking sh- shit. Right I right fucking now, will, dude. dude. I fucking will, too. Oh, my toe. <laughs> <laughs> oh. oh, I have to shit. Oh. Fucking, no. It's this happening. kid, this shit eater was like, Say his, say, dude, his say his name. I don't remember who I, it was. I don't, I don't. I don't remember yeah. who it was. But he's like, yeah, if you eat apple seeds, you'll die because of the cyanide. I'm like, you're fucking smoking the finest dope. Yeah. All right. I'll eat apple seeds right now and prove. I was, I was like, fucking, I ate the apple seeds. I'm like, see you tomorrow, bitch. Right? Mm-hmm. Spit on the floor. See you tomorrow, bitch. <laughs> yeah. Fucking walk away. That didn't happen. And then later that night. Yeah. Fucking, um, I get mm-hmm. home. I immediately get home off the bus. Oh, I guess it wasn't junior year. It must because I did get off the bus. Yeah. And I was fucking, I was sitting. Maybe sophomore? I was sitting on my couch. Or I was lying on my couch. And I kind of had a fever and I was kind of sick. Like, it like just kicked in that day. I think I went to school the next day. It was like, it might have been the, it might have been the apple seeds, dude. Because I straight up. Thought I had to fart and I squirted shit in my pants. It was like a little Hershey fucking squirt shit in my <laughs> pants. As I was laying on the couch, I was like, I was like, oh fuck, I just yeah. shit my pants. Mm-hmm. And that was the last time I shit my pants. I was trying to prove someone wrong. I was like, yeah. I was like, you all eat these fucking apple seeds. They won't kill you. See you tomorrow, bitch. I was like being fucking snarky about it. Yeah. And then I went home and shit my pants. <laughs> I mean, that's could... the moral. There's a moral in that story somewhere. <laughs> yeah. You should have gone back up to him. He didn't die. <laughs> yeah. What's up, dude? All I did was shit my fucking pants <laughs> on the couch, bitch. Yeah. That's all it does, dude. <laughs> I'll, eat all, I'll eat them again. I'll eat all the apple seeds I want, motherfucker. <laughs> yeah, what the fuck? Dude, he would have He would have been dumbfounded. <laughs> like, you shit your pants? Yeah. Yeah, I didn't die. He would have told everybody, dude. <laughs> Little fucker. No, he wouldn't. You wouldn't keep that silent. Dude, Gary shit his pants. He apple seeds. So what? So what? So what? Yeah, I proved you wrong. If you 
Dude, if you owned it, Prove if you would have owned it. Oh, man. Yeah, that would have been mm. so cool, dude. It's a funny story. <laughs> <sighs> Fucking poop talk, dude. We talk about poop too much. No, nah, man. We need the poop well, we'll get over it. Poop scientist immediately. Well, let's talk about uh, something else then. Yeah. Um. Let's talk about. Not like poop. Talk about sex. <laughs> yeah. We could talk, talk about, about poop or sex. <laughs> it's the only options. Um, Food. About poop in sex. Poop, poop during play? sex. You ever shit your pants during sex? So, so actually I'll like uh, poop and rub it on myself as <laughs> yeah, I'm yeah. having sex. Yeah. And I'll like smelling it. And I like when the girl <laughs> poops too. That really turns me on as Come well. Come on, sit together. Come on, fucking poop. Poop. <laughs> <laughs> That's disgusting, dude. That fucking sucks, bro. Did I ask you? Fuck we you. talked about pooping on penis. Excuse me? No, we didn't. I think no, we, we did. talked about farting on a oh, cock. And that's a, gross. A little squirt. Stop, dude. You you would flip out. Fucking stop. Shut up. Why are you so I'm angry? I'm flipping out now. Does this happen? Because it's like we're already... We're already talking about poop and now we're going into poop infested sex. I agree. I don't want to talk about it, Gary, but you brought it up. No, no, no. Um, You brought up poop sex. As the, only, as the only two topics for this conversation it was either poop or sex. I'll give you a topic. Pineapple on pizza. <laughs> <laughs> Guys, we're cocked. <laughs> Episode five is talking it? about pineapple on done. pizza. Fuck, we're, dude. we're fucking done. We're I can't done. believe I can't believe it ended so early. I'm so sorry, man. Yeah, it's your birthday, and the podcast is ending today. It's Fuck, official, dude. guys. <laughs> the podcast <laughs> is over. We ran out of stuff to talk about. Talk about pizza. Talk pizza. <laughs> Are you fucked? The... So, well, only I thing will we li- talk about. I'm actually gonna refuse to talk about. Okay, that. I'm gonna refuse to. Sp- Speak on the subject. How about this? How about this? Anchovies on pizza. Who? Anchovies. Those are fucking na- nasty, dude. That's a good subject. Thank you. Anchovies on pizza. Because listen, what's the, if yeah. you're if okay. you're a picky bitch and you're having pineapples on a pizza, like that's, that's your fucking deal, right? Yeah, yeah. If you're like, I don't like weird stuff on your pizza. That's fine. If you are getting anchovies on your pizza, you're fucked. You like anal. Yeah, you like you like poop sex. Yeah, okay, stop. We're in... <laughs> <laughs> you're into poopy sex. You're into anchovies on your pizza. You like pain. Yeah. You like nipple clamps. You like fucking whips. You yes. like blindfolds. Yes. All right. Mm-hmm. You like bondage. Yeah. If you like anchovies on pizza, you like getting burned. What the fuck? Yeah, you like. <laughs> you, like getting... you were raised in a trailer park. Cigarettes were put out on your arms and yeah. neck. Like, what kind of pizza is that, Dad? Got fucking anchovies on it. <laughs> shut, the, shut up. Shut Wait, the fuck up. This is your half. It's, it has anchovies on it. Oh, shit, dude. <laughs> this is your half. Your fucking shitty dad puts out a cigarette on yeah. your forehead. Your dad brings Open your mouth. An immaculate pizza. Fucking ashes the cigarette. <sighs> Open your mouth. Your dad brings home an immaculate pizza. One half anchovy, one half. This is your half. One half cheese. And he says your half is the fucking anchovy? Yes. I would have killed. I would have fucking killed myself. Yeah. Or I would have loved he it. Says, I would have. Open I would've... your mouth and puts ashes of cigarette yeah. in your mouth. Yeah. <laughs> nah. I mean, I did have. What the fuck is that place like? Zips. We went to Zips Pizza. <laughs> Look up Zips Pizza. I'm looking up fucking. There's fucking Zips Pizza. Who? And they put. I was like, I want to try anchovies. What the fuck did we get? Oh no, that was Jets. Yeah, sure. Zips pizza and fucking it was um anchovies, pineapples, mushrooms, yeah. onions, Three green peppers. Yeah. It was like just completely Turbo fucking... Turbo Crust. That fucking made me sick, dude. Didn't it make you sick? Did you try some? You you liked it. You no, had... it was bad. Dude, you, you ate it and you're like, it's not that bad. You had two slices. Yeah. It was a ten incher. No, I got fucking sick though. I did get sick. I had horrible, like, yeah. fucking bad disease. And then you came morning. up to me, and you're, and you're like, oh, I my, was oh, my stomach hurts. <laughs> and then you shit your pants. I was like, oh, my stomach. <laughs> oh, my stomach. Why does my stomach hurt, Ethan? Probably yeah. because you had 20 anchovies on a fucking cheese pizza. Yeah, that is. With pineapple. Truly, it's not good, man. You fat dick. You fucking 
<laughs> fuck it. No, <laughs> you I chill meant, the fuck out. I meant, I meant your cock size, obviously. No, you're talking. You're saying I'm fat and also no, a dick. No. What does fat dick mean? <laughs> your cock. Oh, thanks, man. Why yeah. would you compliment me for farting? Fat, is fat dick a compliment? No. Yeah. If no, you no, said, no, no. The way you said it just now, you're like, you fat dick. <laughs> you're fat and a dick, not like you have a fat dick. That's not how I meant it. But com- what did say- you mean that the fat dick? What did part, you mean? But saying oh, a fat really? dick and that's a bad. compliment. It's bad. That's a good thing, is it? Yeah, no, dude, it's you not. have a fat dick because that implies girth. Shut the fuck. That up. implies girth, and that's bad. To have yes. a girthy fucking hog. Yeah, dude. What's wrong with that? If you <laughs> what's wrong with having a girthy small but penis? girthy? What a part of fat dick dude, means you, it's small. You gotta find the perfect woman to what to, part of to fucking fat plug di- that no, hammer. No, 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 no. What part of fat dick means it's small? None of it. None of That's it. That's what I exactly. mean. Exactly. So how is it not a compliment? Because it means you have a great Because having a big dick is better and having a small dick is worse, yeah, right? Yeah, and we both have big dicks. Exactly. Is it weird? But that, why is it, why is a fat? Can you fucking? Is it weird can you that, just admit? Is it weird that we never had we never seen each other's penises before? No, that's fine. Okay, that's fine, dude. We can end, we can end this discussion right now. What What do you mean? Let's end this podcast right now. <laughs> Finale. Let's turn off the fucking turn off the audio. Turn off the recording. We're gonna show each other our penises and we're gonna go home. Okay, it's a good idea. Ethan. Well, hmm. Why no more your, beers. Why is yours? <laughs> why is yours brown? No more beers on the podcast, dude. You know, fucking <laughs> whatever the fuck this is. This sucks. <laughs> it's the worst episode yet, but I'm not afraid to say it. Every episode I think is worse than the last. This is the worst one yet. This is the worst one. This is the worst one yet. Absolutely. Yeah. Garrett fucking heed. I unpostable. You you bring home this fucking medicine cabinet of a goddamn fucking beer stand. <laughs> Shit. I mean Goddamn. <laughs> They're still cold. Shit. Shout out Coors, buy Coors, use code Flonius. Yeah, yeah, <laughs> yeah. It's not working. Why the fuck is it working? I'm suing you. Can you say that? That's not... No, you can't fucking be held liable for shit you say. It's satire. I mean, you can. But it's... Really? Well, what's satire? So... Well, no, hold up, because you're a legal expert, right? It's a prank. Can I say I'm going to kill you? Is that illegal? Yeah, it's a prank. Really? Threat. Yeah, dude. Why? It's, it's, it's freedom of speech, threat. dude. Yeah, so freedom of speech doesn't mean you're... Fr- I'm going to fuck your ass and kill you. Is yeah. that illegal to say? I mean, yeah. Really? Yeah, it's a threat. That's the illegal thing to say, though. Do you have to ask me that to know if that's illegal? I literally say it to everyone every day, so it's yeah. like, what the fuck? I'm going to fuck your ass and kill you. Yes. Okay. I said that to someone today, and I'm not kidding. Who? I said, I hope you, like, spit in your mouth. You said that to your dad? I said, I'm going to cut your ears off. No, I just said it to this kid. Okay. <laughs> you're fuck, you're I said it to this twelve year old kid, and that's illegal. Okay. Is what you're telling me? Twelve years old, dude. That that's is what you're telling that's me. A is minor. That, that's illegal. Yes, yeah, so you said that to someone that's twenty years younger than you. That is illegal. Twenty years younger than me. I'm thirty. <laughs> yeah, I'm thirty two. Yeah, yeah. I had no idea about that. Good math skills, bro. I'm not taking legal advice for a fucking dipshit. <laughs> <laughs> I ain't saying I'm a fucking <laughs> mathematician. Man, that's fucking illegal, man. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, you can't be that is illegal, that shit, man. That's a fucking illegal, man. You can't say that to a you kid. You cannot say it somewhat. Let's say it's a legal adult. If you say you're going to fuck their ass and kill them. Yeah. That's illegal? Correct. That's Correct. a threat? Yes. Yes. That's violence. You heard it here first, folks. Speech is violence. What does this country come to? It's come to... Uh, Kamala. <laughs> Kamala. Oh, Kamala. Dude, if they, if they had sex... What if they became a power couple? Dude? Oh, fuck, dude. I'd vote for Finally. Them. I'd, I'd vote, vote for both of them. We're gonna be dual presidents. <laughs> dual president. <laughs> dual presidents for all. <laughs> you said president, dude. Dual president. Fuck, we're forty minutes in. You said president. It's over, dude. <laughs> we're dual president. <laughs> Trump has a Trump list. Trump is retarded. Yeah. <laughs> I took the same stuff that Kamala was taking. I am retarded. <laughs> I become just like her in many ways. <laughs> I am become dwarf. <laughs> the toy of worlds. What if? What if? Yeah, if they would have had a dude a Trump Kamala baby. Holy shit! That would be all sorts of fucked up. That might be the Antichrist. Yes. Finally. He has he has arrived. Yeah. Finally. That's crazy. Do you oh, Trump! That, dude? Trump, you came in me. <laughs> Did not come. <laughs> I came. I'm gonna fucking, I'm gonna fucking come. Dude, they would have monster sex. 
they'd have poop sex. You think? Did you poop yet? Stop, dude. <laughs> this is your fault now. And you're fucking dogging on me. I'm, it's like, a, all we talk about is fucking poop and it's farts, a, It's dude. a throwback. It's a throwback. <laughs> That's a good throwback. Yeah. <laughs> no, dude. Stop, dude. Trump would call it out of poop sex. Why not? They'd have nice fucking missionary. And it'd be great. That's all he could do. Yeah. Dude, he's seven years old? 75? Yeah. Six? Yeah. Dude, he's... How tall is Trump? He's Six fucking... Dude, he could dunk. He's Probably 16? not, actually, because he's old. How tall is he? He's six, past six feet. He's six foot, though. Kamala's tall, too. Really? Yeah. How tall is she? I think she's our height. Which is taller, tall, yeah, tall for a lady. Yeah, tall for a lady. We're six foot, Yeah, we're six foot, so that's we're fucking, fucking tall six five, dude. We're yeah. fucking tall for a yeah, lady, dude. Yeah. Don't say six foot. <laughs> dude, we're not taller than Trump. So Trump and Kamala have a fucking monster. What do you mean monster? Monster baby. What do you mean monster? What are you <laughs> talking a, about? A big baby. They have a fucking it's monster. A big baby. Big fuck. Do they have? Is that a... big? God uh, damn. No. Oh, cut that. Cut Party. That. Party foul. Cut that, dude. That's embarrassing. It is embarrassing. On my, fu- man. On my fucking Goodwill I'm bot sorry, table. Man. I'm sorry. Dude. I should have fucking murdered everyone in that Goodwill. When they said, "Talk about getting this table." That's a good. <laughs> this subject. table was explain was three dollars, and I brought it up to the counter, and they said, "Um, that's not three dollars." Then, then this no, fucking. Can I quote the lady? Sure. She was like, "Nah, not today." <laughs> she didn't say that. Yes, Stop. she did. She yes, she fucking did. She didn't she say that sassy. Nah, nah not she was today. A, you, mm. I swear to fucking God. Bro. Nice try. Not she today. She's literally like, "Nah, not today. No, nah, not today." She did say that, dude. I swear to fucking God. She's like, no, not today. Sorry. No, not today. Was it three dollars? And like, this is fourteen dollars at least. This is fourteen dollars at least. I can give you fourteen for it. Are we and fucking negotiating then? Yeah. What the fuck is that? Here's the thing. I'm not gonna fucking haggle at Goodwill. I'm not gonna start a ruckus. It's over seven dollars. <laughs> Here's. The I th- spent one cent more on a Little Caesars pizza. <laughs> yeah, yeah. You're gonna haggle over that. On a Goodwill table, on a yeah. nice fucking piece of furniture. Yeah, it's a nice piece of furniture. That's not three dollars. Well, it's the only sticker on it. Do you think I printed a sticker and put it on a table? You think I'm trying to fucking jip you? Do you think I fucking hate you? Think you? I'm trying to rob you? I'm gonna kill you. <laughs> and that's illegal to say. <laughs> it is. Yes. It is. Over it is. Seven dollars. It is illegal to say that. Are you sure? To say you're. I'm gonna, not taking legal advice. Say you're gonna I kill forgot. someone. <laughs> I it's in jest. All right, we got two minutes. So I'm like, it's a joke. Yeah. And that's illegal still? Even though it's a joke? Correct. Your Honor, <laughs> it was a joke. I didn't mean that you're dressed as, as the... So as, what the fuck? It was a joker. <laughs> as the John Claire did? You're dressed as the John Claire. Let's talk about that movie. And no. More. The movie is bad. It was terrible. If I would have done it, I would have made it a full blown musical. We close it out. I would have made Joker a fucking gay guy. Mm. Where he liked getting raped. Did he get raped? Yes, dude. How yes, you, he how... got fucking raped. That's so ambiguous, though. I... He got raped. Everyone else, because I literally went to you and I was like, did he get raped? And you're like, I don't know. You're like, I missed that. I don't know. And <laughs> then I went Stop online. The fuck? I didn't say that. No, you did. You're like, oh. you're I don't like, know. What? When did he get know. raped? Fucking, what are you fucking... I know, but I mean, like, is that, was the that... The guy was literally was holding proven? his fucking chin, he was like this, with his finger. He was, like, touching his lip, the side of his lip. Oh, he fucking... wiped off his makeup. Do you remember him wiping off the lipstick? You fucking like he that? He wiped off the makeup just like this. Dude. I will say, I will. I, I have met that couple. Like, Joker and Harley. I fucking love you. I've met them. Hey. He got I mean, fucked raped. I I don't care about that. I don't care <laughs> I about. Guess not, I don't dude. care about Arthur Fleck getting not. raped in the ass. He got dude. fucking raped. Why? The rape. Hey, this guy talked bad about us at core. Let's fucking rape him. Yeah. God damn. Because killing him wasn't enough. The Gotham security at Arkham is terrible. And then fucking Harley Quinn's like, hmm, he got raped. I'm not into you anymore. You're weak. <laughs> Bye. Real men don't get raped. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Oh fuck! That movie fucking sucked. It was bad. Um, Why didn't you like it? 
So why don't you like it though? Because I have reasons why I don't like it. <laughs> we'll go more in depth, but I I gotta leave. Do you I, actually? I have to I have to be at that place at seven. Well, how t- how long do you, how long is the drive? Well, let me ask the fiance, and let me see let me see the response yeah, that I get. Wife. Let me ask the wife. right now. I have to pee too. Why didn't you like fucking Joker, dude? Because it was, I didn't like it because there was no Just direction. Final fucking there was there was no vision, and I don't like because it kind of ended similar to how the first one ended, except he dies this time, and I don't I don't care for that. Yeah. How about you have the fucking security guards dance around and sing too? Why only the Joker and fucking Lee? I heard everyone yapping about like all the endings like crazy. It wasn't. It fucking sucked. It was a shitty ending to a yeah. shitty movie. And fuck you. I I I really gotta pee. And the episode's <laughs> over. Fuck your shit. Happy birthday. Happy birthday, Ethan. Say everyone, guys, everyone in the comments said, tell Ethan a happy birthday. And thank you so much for watching. And I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm so fucking sorry. <laughs>